Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for walking among us and for letting men experience your protection. Even when we are dying, you protect and help us so that we need not pass into death but may enter into life. So may our hearts be lifted up to you, grant that the light in us remains undimmed, and that we may come before you in sincerity. Lord God, create good out of evil let light down in the darkness fulfill your promise for our hearts are not concerned with human desires but with your promise you will carry it out and we will be able to say our faith was not in vain our hope was not in vain you have blessed us a thousand fold lord our god we thank you that you have given us your glorious future has the basis of our lives We thank you that on this foundation we can forget our present troubles and beliefs that the power of God can move us today to off sign death and everything evil free our hearts from all burdens and grant that we may have courage to wait patiently for the great help which is to come grant that what is happening in the world today may somehow help toward the solution of all the problems We praise your name, our Father in the heavens. We praise you for the good you do for us each day and for the life you will share one day on everything on earth to the glory of your name. You fill heaven and earth with your spirit and allow us to share in your gifts. We thank you for all you have given us, for all you are given and will give. We are poor and needy All people are poor and needy in spite of their striving longing and seeking only you through your spirit can awaken something in us to help us go toward your goal Keep us from being caught up in what men do the greatest help for our hearts is what you do and each of us can tell something about it Each of us has received help beyond anything we had hoped or thought of. How much you have done for us, how much you are doing for the nations. Yes, we thank you for this present time. Although our lives often seem hopeless and full of sorrow, your powers are still living among men, working for their good and awakening them to new life. The time will surely come when our hearts will be released from their anger and we can be filled with the life from above which you give us in Jesus Christ. Amen.